Welcome back to Pokemon Plays. He has a B for an eye. Oh, he does. <laughs> he has a Bakshin for an eye. Bleh. All right, Rick from Rick and Morty. That's one of my, the only things I don't like about that show is that Rick's character thing is that he's an alcoholic, mm -hmm. and so he always has a little bit of drool on inside of his mouth, and he's always like mid conversation just burping. Yeah. Morty, we got burp. we gotta go to the thing to get the burp. And you're like, ugh. What? It's less. It's like annoying in the first couple episodes because they're trying to establish his character, but then it stops being a big deal. Oh, dude. You know spare body is? from a straw. Yeah. So this is a boss fight. Yep. Doesn't set up like one. It's because it's just like, hey, guess what you're doing? Fight. Oh, it's supposed to be surprising. Yep. Oh, cool. So it's not her. It's just a like. It's just an AI in her spare body. Do, do you fight it the same way? Yep. Interesting. It has That's... all her combat data. That's weird. That's a, a kind of it's a kind of a clever in-universe way to rehash a boss fight. But yuck. It has her music though. Oh, it has the booty doody 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 doody. That one? Sure. Oh, it does. That's great. Alright, you guys are gonna get a couple seconds of sweet, delicious Metal Gear music that might get us copyright flagged. Ready? Here we go. Alright. It's good Sorry. stuff. I actually I can't mute us during that part because then we definitely get flagged if it's just music, but. Mm -hmm. Did you see the guy who composed the soundtrack? He probably won't come after you. Uh, Jamie Christopherson? Pretty sure it's a guy. Yep. Sounds like a European guy. Oh, yeah, Christopherson. Jamie. Why is she just constantly losing health? Oh, it's because you're kidding. <gasps> now she's a whip, that's Get different. She did she have a whip before? Yes, she did. Oh. I just remember being on a roof, or on like a rain pipe. Great. Yep. Clicky 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 clicky. That that gecko's gonna explode. It's like that episode of Rugrats. Where they have the baby that can only increase the damage. It was like Angelica. Hey, when I keep starting the Ripper mode, whenever she starts running away, so I can't keep it running. Otherwise, I'll lose all the my electrolytes. I need a ball of Gatorade. Dead on. Here you go. She keeps blocking though, so I don't get. Energy from that. Wait, favorite flavor Gatorade. I'm oh, gonna, I'm gonna I'm gonna have given it to you right there. What's your favorite flavor Gatorade? Uh, I think the Blue Rush or whatever the hell it is. Okay. Good to know. Somehow dodged that whip. How many bosses are? What's which numbered boss is this? This is like the. Let's see. There was Metal Gear Ray, then Blade Wolf. Uh, there was the Sam fight at the beginning, and then we fought. Mistral and then Monsoon was before this. So this is number six? Yes. Out of, you said, nine? Something like that, yeah. Wow, we are cranking them. Yep. <laughs> slicey, slicey, slicey. Hot chip hey, jam, Slicey. Hot chip A lot of things to do. <laughs> hey, Slicey. You guys, I need your uh, your juices. I need One and only cutter. With the one and only sword, and you know how to make the best thing, take the thing and make it pretty good. Frosted tips. Frosted are tits. More than dumb. They're weird. It's trying to be insult with anyone with that. At least politically offensive. Hey, you did it. She's done. You hit, you hit uh, Bobby, Bobby Drake, Mr. All. But that's not the end of it. <gasps> Guess who's back? Back again, again, again. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. It's gonna end the episode. There it is. Oh my god. Oh, cool. I guess that's... Oh, this, so you have to do this whole fight again? Yep. That's annoying. It's just like, hey. Is it easier, at least? Or it's uh, about the same, but I was good enough at it the first time. And you have the cool sword now. Defeat ah. Monsoon's body, though. So it's just like, in, before you get to Sundown, it's just like, fight Mo Mistral and Monsoon again. So you're going to fight Sundowner after this? Yeah, after this, Sundowner will be the next. Oh, so we probably... Okay. I got well, he won't, it, he won't be immediately after this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's we'll have a little bit to go. Yeah. 
Use what? Food will be soon. I love so we'll that. take a take a food break and then we can uh, fight Monson. Monson, Mon Downer. Fight Monson. It's like the fusion dance of Sundown and Monsoon. Could, could I want I you I wonder if they actually could do a fusion dance since they're cyborgs. What's the requirements for that? Yeah, well, I mean, the androids did a fusion dance. Did they? No. What? Don't believe me. I haven't watched Into the Boo Saga yet. No, there aren't a lot of android things that happening in the Boo Saga. Eighteen is there. She's just being a mother. Me, sweet milk. Uh, I'm sorry, I said that. Uh, what's gonna say? Uh. I d I like to think I like that I'm realizing that the like one connecting plot thread of Plot Modern Play Season Three is you're watching DBZ. Hey, no. Because that's from yeah, Link to the Past Session One up to now. Check, check, slice, slice. And when we're like finishing, I'm Future Trunks. I'm gonna slice you. Oh. And when we're finishing unannounced the next game in like July, he'll still be like, oh, oh. I'm on uh, a fucking whatever Battle of the Gods. So you wait. Question. Yes. Oh, go ahead. Say your thing. I didn't have anything to say. Uh, you watched Battle of the Gods, but isn't that a sequel to everything? Yes. So, to that was that not weird for you? No, it was fine. It didn't. It didn't really spoil anything, because it was just like, Boo's there, but I already knew Majin Boo was a character, and like, it really didn't spoil anything, it just had characters there from oh, Boo Saga, right. like Gotenks and stuff, but... Oh, dude, Gotenks. Dude, Gogeta. Dude, Vegito. <laughs> That's all we need. It like, mentions some stuff that happened in the Boo Saga, like, maybe I should fuse with Vegeta to be able to beat Beerus, but no, it wouldn't be powerful enough still. It just like, mentions some stuff in passing. The trick, the trick was just to be angry, Vegeta. Yeah. Bummer. Well, that's not the end of the movie. That scene that you saw. That's like, at a point when Beerus goes to Earth. Oh, we're good. But yeah, you need to watch that movie. I will, eventually. Because it's good. It's good? We're good. <clears throat> Whoa! It's like the library from Star Wars. Mm-hmm. This is cool. Where, where are we? We're in the server room. <laughs> the Google server room. Find the computer room. <laughs> you need to put up a picture of Vector the Crocodile when you do that. <laughs> Look at those headphones. Look at them. <laughs> yep. Classic Vector. I'm more of a... Who's the character on the game? Uh, Charmy B. Nope. I did like Charmy B in Sonic Heroes. How? Charmy the B. Charmy. He like had like one bark that he would always use, and I hated it. Fang the Sniper. That's my uh, favorite. Or Jack the Weasel. Fuck Jack. That's his name. What was the really bad 3D fighting one? Sonic the Fighters. Yeah. Which was like Virtual Fighter, the Sonic game. Yeah, let's play that on the show. We could. Once we get a capture card, we absolutely could. Wait, do you have it on Genesis? Uh, I think I have... So it's somewhere. On Genesis? Not on Genesis, but on, like, a GameCube. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say. Could figure it out. I think I have something on, uh... Maybe on Xbox that has it. I'm just kidding. That's not that's not, that game's terrible. <laughs> oh, it's Sam Smith. Nope, that's not Sam. That's, uh, Sundown. That is Sundown. No names now. It just, like, actually hits into her. You learn their names as soon as, uh, ha more than half of them are dead. <laughs> dead, and the next one's about to be dead. Or prime this. Blah, 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 that. Kids. That's how I understand it. Sundowner is just an asshole. Sandra, something smells really good. That's a dinner. That's not my farts. <laughs> Your farts wouldn't smell good anyways. You don't know that. I do know that. You've never smelled my farts before. You probably, probably have. have. You just don't see the bigger picture. <laughs> it's a brain. It's a peck on the cheek for Xander. It's a kid's brain, and he's just holding it. Is that George's brain? No. George is with the doctor. Are we going to see George again? Yes. Good. But the server room is just where the... This is where all the brains are? Yes. He's really weirdly shaped. Yep. He's a big guy. I think it's because he's wearing a robe and you don't know where his legs are. So it's just like, he looks like he has a big tiger very top heavy. Probably is. Yeah. No! <laughs> he looks so scared. Yep. Oh, hey. He's after MGS4. Yes. Oh, a company, eh? Part of some big old conspiracy because I'm a warmonger. 
Whoa. The mirage. Why fight it? I like that it is a southern accent. I think it's from Alabama. Really? Pretty sure. Alright, guys. Sundowner is a warmonger. Yep. We're not. You're good. We're good. We're good. I'm just saying, like. The food will be soon. Damn. Yeah, oh, right now. Perfect timing, guys. Next time Bob Martin plays, we're gonna have be full of food and we're gonna fight Sundowner. We're gonna be energized. We're energized to fight Sundowner? Yep. Bye. Well, first I'm gonna. Wait. I'm just gonna use one of them and use one of them. Nice. Right, energized. See you next time. Bam.